Hey y'all, welcome back to Gaming Reactor with me, Atomic Fire Penguin, and we're playing Frambo now. Um, this game's so much fun. Um, now let's see if we can't deal with these, like, that little weird ass pine cone family. Um, cause we were having a little bit of trouble last time. Get the meat. Ew. Yeah, I don't think you'd mind. I wouldn't mind. I mean, you get hungry. I mean, that meat's probably rotten. Okay, you don't like touching meat. That's cool. Um, that's pretty gross. That's extremely gross. <laughs> Why didn't we do this before? <laughs> I don't know. Um... Looks fine. Hmm. The bag's open. Is it? Is it really? Okay, use it then. Is that? It's some sort of card. Let's look at the card. Exterminator. Hmm, the text is almost gone. He's the worst exterminator ever. It says exterminator. Poor tiny monster. She likes bugs. Okay. Good to know. Good to know she likes bugs. Can I combine stuff? Okay, I guess not. Got you. Sorry, sir, but I really need these berries. Yes. Okay, cool. Got the berries. I forgot I could knock that kid over. Okay. Now. Oh, she gets to have a kitty on this bed, but I think that under the blanket could be lots of creatures. Probably. That's kind of gross. It could be used for heat. Uh, hi, lady. Lady, lady. Okay. Let's cross the thingy. I'm really sorry about this. Hi, Mr. Rat. What? You're not my cat. Oh, miss. You saved me from misery. Where's Mr. Midnight? But where's Mr. Midnight? I assume you're feeling disappointed. Who are you looking for? My cat, my lovely cat, Mr. Midnight. Oh, Miss Lady, I'm not very fond of cats, you know. Black one with very big yellow eyes are trying to catch me. Mm, really? You seem to get in trouble often. Wait, maybe he's my cat. Oh, my lady, if he is, then he's one in trouble now. What happened? Why? What happened? I can show you. Follow me, please. Not very far from here. Thank you. Help me. That was a rat. I can't. Just, you know. Inside a beetle pig. Inside the beetle pig. There's no cat, but a rat. A rat? Oh, I'm sorry. You see, my eyes are very old. As I have heart problems. Very bad back. I also suffer from narcolepsy. Sometimes I don't. Okay, let's follow the rat. Hmm. 
here we are. Someone took a mess. They just disappeared. Be more specific. <laughs> no, she could, but it looked like the war the earth swallowed him or them. If there's anything else I can do for you, just let me know. I'll be around. Rat, who did this to you? Was it my kitty? Whoa, hi. Creepy guy. A fat but he didn't have the... Excuse me, did you steal a hair comb? Oh, a hair comb? The hair comb? The shiny, beautiful hair comb? Can I have it? Please? Alright then, but can you please comb my hair first? Yes, I can comb your hair. Thank you, my lady. You're very kind. I don't have to know I come the rat's hair with it. No one will ever know. Except you and me. Here's your beautiful comb, misters. Oh, you found the person. You finally did it. Hope the door, the key opens the door you wish to open. Now we fly south at last. Goodbye. Bye. Hello, oh, beautiful. Goodbye, shiny misters. Have a nice trip. Okay. I got the key. Okay, cool. What a bluff. There's no hole here. Gotta use it on the door. And the key on the Combine that with the door. Use the... Use. My own door's locked. Ugh. That's like... Okay. I'm with her on this one. It's like, why would... Understand? I don't. What a curious little door. How you to fit in there? I wonder where it will lead me downstairs. Just a midnight. Are you here? Uh. Ew. Eyeball touching with tentacles. From the hand. Hand tentacles. Double personality. Oh my goodness, where am I? Huh, what's this? A hat? Mr. Midnight. Oh no, your head. Kitty. Yeah, wait a second. I'm not my kitty. Where it hat. Uh I hope so too. Welcome home, beautiful kitten. We hope you like your new bed. Be nice and eat your food. Love Clara and Mia. I won't lay down. And that thing. Okay. Okay, so what looks like a thing of coffee. Apparently some eyeballs. An awesome skull. 
head from a human, I guess. Yep. You guessed right. Okay, so I have a feeling we have to do something with this window at some point. A painting of a teapot. Painted tea inside. It doesn't... Unless you're using your imagination. A cooker to cook. Okay. Cookies. Honey. A thing. A flower. What is that? Baking. Okay, cool. Now we have baking soda for some reason. A pine cone. I don't dare touch it. Maybe it'll attack me. Yeah, I don't blame you. Okay, so spatula. Sounds like Dracula. But in this ball. It kind of does. Ooh. Yeah, she won't like matches, but she'll play with knives. That's cool. Jumping little hands. Soup. Okay. Mr. Midnight, those girls, they took my kitty. I don't like to be selfish, but it, that's my kitten. If I were to keep the chimney warm. Okay. Let's drug up a second. Well then, hello little baby, what are you doing here? Uh, we don't speak of that. We will never speak of that, ever. Oh, I see you have a comfortable there, little baby. Oh, this is inside the well. Holy shit, okay. You seem fresh, are you still alive? No. Secret bottles. So So okay. That is the other world. That's the pill that's the drugged up world. So maybe Like, why? The bag smells funny. I don't touch it. Like beans, salt. Okay, cool. We have salt. What's that? Open. What's that inside? It looks like tentacles. I don't know whose mush it is. I like where this girl's mind goes, like, <laughs> scroll body parts. Pepper, okay, cool. Rice, beans, oats, and a bird. Hold pretty can. Okay. It looks like a plant. Yes. Because it is a plant. Oh, Dancing Teddy, it doesn't have shoes. <sighs> Matches. What's this? It's, they don't smell, they must be plastic flowers. I open the window. I cannot. What's just, what's just take? Okay, let's move on then. Hmm. Faces look familiar. I'm not sure. Could be. Your face is low. Hmm. 
A tiny house in the middle of nowhere. Oh, yeah, okay. Teapot has no tea at all. Not my cup. Caramel sauce. That sounds delicious because I am hungry. Closing form. Face to put some flowers in. It has a what? I don't think burn things here that I really don't need. Can you though? Yes, it is a flying pig. I'll try not to click by so far. What the? Okay. Okay. I, I see what's going on. Monster who likes goats. Draw open. Yes. Let's see. candles. Okay. The sister who okay, they're twins. A rose painting. Let's go in here first. Holy shit. <laughs> this perfume smells like teenagers. What do teenagers smell like? Okay, so we have all this stuff. Oh, these toys are so Hello doll, who caught you? I hope this never happens to me. It looks like a very old painting. Ah, that monster and so much blood. Here. But why is my reflection out there? And why is there a keyhole? <laughs> Probably. Hi, ghost girl. What's up? Oh, okay. Umbrella? What's that? It's a rat. It's time to get up. I was in the attic there with Carrie Sadness. Hmm, a lot of tiny stuff. Is that an angel's head? I don't guess with this for two because I don't need it. What a pretty doll. I like the hairstyle. There's a scorpion. A scorp I feel the same way about spiders. Just one hat. I thought this is. Hmm. Is they the sisters? Why are they so old? Foxy, oh no, I wish I could help you out of here. Just a minute. Whoa. Yeah. I found you. It's you. Oh my goodness, my beloved friend, I found you. Friend, is that really you? Oh dear, finally. Let me see you. It's me. Come closer. Let me see you. Oh, friend, I'm so happy to see you. I missed you very much. I had dreams about you. And here you are. Thank you for not giving up. I love you, my friend. Oh, 
I love you too, Mr. Midnight. And I really missed you. Oh, dear friend. How did you find this place? After those people took you away in the woods, I tried to follow them. But after a while I got lost, my senses were too weak to track you. I tried to catch some food to recover, but something happened. Somebody took me and put me in this cage. Oh my Oh my dear, I will open this cage. You need to get to Aunt Grace. Fran, I'm very tired. I wish everything was just a bad dream. Everything's gonna be fine. I'm just gonna get you out of here. Fran, can I ask you something? Sure. What is it? Do you feel my presence in your dreams? Yes, I did. You told me to take the medicine and found you. What medicine, Fran? I wasn't really talking. What medicine? What medicine, Fran? It wasn't really me talking to you. I think somebody was helping us get together. Every time I had a dream about you, I felt the presence of something else. A presence? Really? What kind of presence? For what I felt, it wasn't human, but it was really peaceful and kind. That's magic. That's the real magic. Great to have someone else taking care of us. Fran, did you hear that? Did you? Oh, let's see what it is. Try to find the key and I'll unlock you. Alright, I love you. Okay, girl. I don't know. Oh, you scared me. I thought nobody was living here. There you are. I'm waiting for you. Where's your head? My head? My head's just in the right place. You, the precious thing from the other world. Who would ever believe us? I'm confused. <laughs> Ladies, what are you talking about? Frambo. That's your name, right? And your mom and dad died tragically. Very brutal, right? And now you really want to know who killed them, right? You're scaring me. How can you know all this? We just know. We have to. We're part of this world. Don't be sad. Bad things happen to all of us all the time. I wish I was home with my mommy and daddy now. Don't wish for things that can't be done. Find solutions and answers. I can't see solutions. But the pain I feel is so great I can't see solutions. Drink some tea and eat some cake. It will make you feel better. Told you about me. Thank you, but really, I need to know who told you these things about me. You scared little friend. I'm confused. Of course not. I'm just curious, that's all. I'm mostly confused. You haven't asked about your cat yet, Mr. Midnight. That's very odd for a girl who loves her cat more than anything else in the world. And yet, you look so calm after finding him in a cage, hungry and scared. Shouldn't it be us trembling in fear of you? I love him and that's why I'm here. I didn't mean to be rude to you. You want him back? Duh. I want you to unlock the cage. He's hungry and thirsty, please. Before we set him free. Tell us about how it is you came here. It's a long story. I escaped from a place. A very ugly place. They opened, head of, they opened the heads of children to find out what was wrong with them. Phil told me a secret and I was clever enough to find the way out. And then I came into the woods and met a giant ant. 
and I killed him. Or, and I killed a bug. It was terrible. And then I met a rat who wanted to get his hair done. And then I made a door, and that door took me here. But when I entered the door, something happened. I don't remember anything else. Ah, and I saw real pinecone family. That was before I came here. They lived in Mr. Antonio's house. They like berries. Ah, and I saw flying insects. They got stuck in trees. Because they have long hair. I was also in the woods. And now I'm here looking for Mr. Midnight. That was some adventure. How old are you from? I'm 10. But I turn 11 soon. And you? You're 16 years old. Much older than you. So, you have to obey us. Can you tell me what to do? I don't want to obey you. Can you tell me what to do? You haven't even asked our names. That's not polite. And you shouldn't wander around in a house without permission. Are you stupid? A stupid little girl with no family at all? Not stupid. And I don't have a family. I have an Aunt Grace and I do have a family. I have an Aunt Grace and my kitten. Are you crying? Because if you are, you'll get in trouble. If you don't do exactly as we say, you and your cat will die. Do you understand? You don't scare me. You're my cat now. You idiot. You asked for it. If you don't want... If you don't do what we ask for, bad things will happen to your cat. We will force you to kill him with your own hands. I don't know, please. I'll do whatever you ask for. Good. I'll listen to us carefully. We need you to perform a little magic trick on us. Do you like magic? Magic is magical. Who doesn't like magic? Anyway, this magic is very powerful. It's tremendous and dangerous. Here's the recipe. Be cautious and precise. Otherwise, terrible things can happen. I don't know if I can. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to. Do it yourself. You can't do it. It would kill us, you see. We weren't like this before. We used to be two different people. In two different bodies. But how is it you're like this now? On a night a long time ago, something appeared in front of us. We thought it was an angel, but it wasn't. He decided that we should spend eternity together. He cursed us to be like this. We never understood why. We have a spell to bring him back. But we will do that later. We are not attached when we're not attached to each other anymore. And show them that he's powerless. And he will regret it. I'll try my best. That sounds terrible. I'll try my best to help you. You're going to gather some things you'll need for the ritual. And because you've been such a nut, very nutty girl, we won't even be able to talk to you. You won't be able to talk to your cat. You'll have to wait until we come back. Oh, please let me talk to him. Let me give him some food. No, you can't. And friend, do you see this key? Can you imagine what can be opened with it? I'm guessing the mirror. Can you, silly, silly girl? <laughs> well, then. My goodness, the smell. Poor girl, who could have done this? <laughs> I have a feeling. Huh, wait a minute. That's the big ant from the woods. It could be him. A little bit younger. A regular player. 
I wonder if it works. Let's see. Oh, there. It works. Oh, typewriter. And it works. Guess I could write. There's no paper. Good writer has to know what to write about first. Burning candles. Owls and cats are a bit alike. The stairs end up to a wall. Okay, so. Oh, hi, Mr. Skulldude. It's him again. But I haven't taken my pills. Well, he opened the window. Thank you. But who is he? Hey, you. Yes, who's speaking? Me. I'm a toad. I have to tell you something. What is it? You're in great danger. Don't trust the girls. Why do you say that? Oh girl, I'm a toad. And I don't know. Er, I'm a toad. And I know I can swim away from this place. But they won't let me every time I try to get out of here. I magically come back. This house is like a huge magnet. A toad. A cat magnet. A toad and cat magnet. They love us. But not to give us love. Just to use us. Don't trust them. That's terrible. That's why my kitty's here then. They gave a recipe for some kind of magic, right? Yes, they did. You see the dead girl in one of the rooms? Yes, I did. Well, that could be you if you do it. Well, that can be you if you try to do it. She tried, but she did it wrong. What should I do? I'm not a clever toad, but if I were you, I would be creative. Huh, creative. I try to do my best. And girl, please save us all. I really want to get out of here. Salmon, you know, heart of a frog, the head of a young virgin, hair on blood from a black hat, a pentagram made of ashes, the burnt body of a fox. Okay, let's see if I can. Doubters need the truth. On paper. My sister's trying to catch me, but I ran away. I'm a rusty bicycle. I'm scared, would you help me? Uh, no, I guess not. Big, big rock. Oh, here. Okay, that sounds like a good idea. Okay. Good job, frog. Uh, that's bomb. Why? There's no ah, it burn. Why? There's no fire. It's just bottle. It really burns. Oh, 
Blood from an execute. Blood from the executor of the ritual. A blue bloomed moonlight rose. Hair from a person you wish to bewitch. Okay, I'm gonna leave it here for now. Uh, <clears throat> I gotta find out what the hell's going on. Um, and so yeah, thanks guys for watching. If you like this video, there's a button down there. I think it's down there in this direction. Down there, it's the sub button. Click on it. Sub if you want or like around there too there's a little like and dislike button click the like button and leave a comment um if you want and so maybe we'll get further next time thank you so much for watching again i appreciate you as always and peace out